Hi and welcome back to the overview of this completely original Ministry of Defence Garrod 301 serial number 53890 which I think you can just about see there. This is the original Garrod factory paint finish obviously the original Garrod factory faceplates with the Ministry of Defence signifier with the broad arrow there this unit was purchased by the Ministry of Defence for use on open days apparently and for the occasional ball according to the previous owner and then it was popped back in its box and there are certain things to look out for when we're looking at very nice condition original finish units and it's things that denote a little bit of the wear and so just observe the original brake pad this has not been replaced Normally these are blackened, they're flattened, they're misshapen or completely out of spec but that shows that this unit's been turned on and off hardly at all. And we can move across to things like the idler wheel here which runs fantastically smoothly. The bushes are absolutely tight, fantastic. The speed disc shows no markings, no waves, no chops or dings. And you can even see some of the iridescence of the original plating here. This is the cadmium finish. Another little indicator is the inner rim of the platter. And we've not cleaned this. This is a non-strobe platter. Normally you'll have three bands if, if the uh, previous owners were using 33, 45 and 78. And again, this is absolutely wonderful condition. There's the HDA stamp. I'm just moving around to give a sense of that the spindle itself is very very smooth it really is a wonderful original example and we often get asked for original examples and to be honest it's uh, not something that we often do but um, apart from new old stock units we can see that this unit hasn't been replated, uh, repainted you can see the test stamps and you can just see the condition of the linkages which I mean, these are the cadmium plates that always oxidise. In absolutely fantastic condition, even with the original Garrett grease on the linkages there. What we have done to this unit, as, as needs to be done with all units, even new old stock, is to completely strip and rebuild the motor. Um, and that's just the nature of time in combination with lubrication and storage, which, which requires it. Um, we've also completely stripped and rebuilt the spindle housing of course and this unit is running bang on speed as can be evidenced in the previous video on this listing and is running very very quietly and the, the, the motor has had nowhere to the bushes it's really uh, quite special the platter mat of course is very supple no cracking or difficulties with the rubber there at all And this is the original hammer tone paint on the frame. And the spindle housing itself is exceptionally clean. Altogether, it's a real privilege to work on a unit like this, and it's certainly, with the Ministry of Defence plates, an unusual one. And certainly a privilege to own. Many thanks indeed for watching.